The poster that was presented at APIC was designed to provide information on a protocol for disinfecting needless connectors. The access points are a major concern in terms of compliance and infection prevention. The infographic shows very clearly the mechanism of action for alcohol and how it breaks down the cell wall. Uh, a nice way to say it is cell death by IPA. When we think in terms of disinfecting needless connectors, the current method that's used typically is with an alcohol wipe, just a prep pad. It's fairly ineffective based on research that we now have and typically clinicians will not spend an adequate amount of time uh, with friction or with scrubbing back and forth or even wiping more than just a swipe. Even with the alcohol prep pad and an adequate amount of time, there are issues over different needleless connectors and gaps and crevices and, and other issues that make it very difficult for an alcohol wipe alone to be effective in decontaminating the needleless connector. The other protocol that's outlined in the infographics shows that uh, a particular cap that bays the injection site with alcohol can be more effective, especially over five minutes. In fact, by bathing the area with alcohol, it allows it to penetrate the cell and to disrupt the cell of the bacteria much more effectively and maintain that disinfection for a longer period of time so that each time you go back to the needleless connector to access, you know that, it is, that it's clean and ready for access.